Hey everybody, David here and I have an awesome announcement to make. Coming soon we're dropping a brand new video series called the Firebase Database for SQL Developers. Welcome to the second, oh, I held one up there for a while. First, you create a reference to the parent key, and then you use an ordering function. JSON is simple. All right. So now using the Firebase Database SDK, I'll create a reference to our user's reference yet again. And now we want to order by child and specify the name. So we're querying based upon the name. First, we get the database object, and then we're going to create a reference to the parent key, which is events. And it's at this point that we can begin our query. The Firebase database is a NoSQL database, and if you're coming from a SQL background, you might be wondering, how do I do a join? What's the equivalent to a foreign key? What's the best way to structure my data? And how do I protect my data structure? I've designed this series to bridge the gap between styles in SQL databases and styles in the Firebase database. We're going to start with the basics and then move our way up to more advanced techniques. We're going to start with comparing SQL to NoSQL, converting SQL data structures to Firebase data structures, converting SQL queries to Firebase queries, handling joins, denormalizing your data, multipath updates, and security rules to protect your data structure. So make sure to subscribe to get notified when the series launches, and I will see you in the first lesson. Thanks for watching our video. You might also want to check out this video, or even this one. I really like that one. And make sure to subscribe. And now uh, you just watch me try to catch popcorn in my mouth. Oh, two in a row.